contact her until that valve was closed. All right. Did any pressure go back? Mm -hmm. Fucking dandy. How would you be able to see the pressure gauge? If, if, you, know, you can you can move the gauge. As well. I just got that for you to see it. Okay. You can hang them over here okay. if you want. You know, okay. put them wherever you're comfortable, dude. You're the boss of these bitches. Don't don't let them fucking. These are your tools, man. Utilize them. Don't let them utilize you. <laughs> All right. So no pressure in the system, right? So right now we can go over here, replace a copper line set, replace your TXV, replace your evaporator coil. Go seal it back up. And then you leak check with nitrogen. Grab that tank off. It takes that. But yeah, grab it anyway so I can see. So that's a nitrogen tank right there. These tanks are usually about 180 in the supply house. All right, you only gotta buy it once. After that, it's normally like $14, $30, depending on where you go, to just keep it refilled. And then this regulator is like 80 bucks. Just to give you an idea of the tools you need to do the job, right? All right. Okay, so we leak checked, which means pressurize the system with nitrogen after we sealed it. I put it to like 150 and hold it for about five minutes. All right. You'll know if there's a leak because that pressure will go. Yep. And again, just pressure will start going back down. But if there's no leak, boom, immediately go to pull in a vacuum, all right? And if y'all look on these gauges, or <coughs> fuck, pull them out. Y'all see that green, negative 30? All right, so on these kind of cheap little gauges, all you can do is pull it down to that negative 30 and hold for, you know, hold a vacuum for 45 minutes at least. Show your gauges off. Make sure it holds pressure, all right? Because if there's still moisture and contaminants in there, it'll go back up to zero. Okay, so we went over here and replaced a fucking evaporator coil and TXV. We leak checked. We pulled a vacuum. Now we're ready to release the refrigerant. All right. And go charge our customer. And we're done. Right. And the way you do that high side first. So you close the high side first and you open the high side first, alright? Flip it. Watch my gauges. 